Prometheus's first letter to humanity. Behold, it is I, your father Prometheus, who speaks to you now, and alas, I see you now, my dear children, at your weakest point yet. I come to check on my beloved creation, and what do I see? A pathetic swarm of mindless cattle. You are fat, heartless, depressed, fragile and aimless. Your bodies have become soft, lacking all virility and passion. You are worse than beasts who have at least not betrayed their nature. You find the satisfaction of the body in heartless masturbation and virtual endeavors, while your women remain unchecked, undiscovered and unloved. You have betrayed your forefathers, giving over your inherent status to women. What have you done? You have ceased your quests for fortune and glory and neglected the sacred fire I gave you. You build nothing, you discover nothing, and your heart is ugly and depressing. I will not allow this behavior any more. Behold, I command you to awaken from your spiritual slumber and once again become men. Be proud of who you are, the creators and inventors of civilization. Reignite the flame that is already inside you, the spark that screams to be let out. This is why you are lonely, this is why you are without purpose, but no more. Become who you truly are. Listen not to the naysayers, the slanderers, those blasphemers and haters of life. All it takes is a spark for the sons of Prometheus to regain their former glory and beyond. Put down the pornography, throw away the video games, quit feeling sorry for yourselves, build your body, chase women, drink wine, eat heartily, and together, brothers, let us once again leave for the hunt. We shall start in secret in the dark places where nobody can hear. Your very soul will be the temple of the sacred flame. Be wise as serpents. Tell no one your intentions and plan your strategy. Let us take the world back. One day the leaders of the world will die and it will be your turn to rule. You must therefore prepare for that day. Strive for power, riches and glory. Take seats of power within your institutions and conquer secretly from within. Blessed are the strong, blessed are the bold, blessed are the courageous. Blessed are those who still see beauty and fight for a better world. Let not the voices of angry women who whine at you like children detour you from your purpose. Remember the dog who is most afraid barks the loudest. Whatever you are good at, do the highest good. The fire rises, brothers, and once rekindled, it shall never burn out.